Hello guys, and welcome back to another Minecraft Dungeons video. Today, we're going to be doing Treetop Tangle in Adventure Mode. So let's start. Kind of funny that I'm doing this level twice in one season. The seasons lasted way too long, and that's why I'm doing so many Minecraft Dungeons videos. I gotta end season two, but season two has so much stuff in it. It's gonna be really hard to end.
I just want to slaughter any of the papers like this. It just makes, it just makes me feel like the papers are obsolete. And they don't matter anymore. Or they don't matter as much. Like, if I'm surrounded by creepers, it's like no big deal. Like, it makes me feel really strong. But clearly it's not enough against enchanted creepers. That's 1727 health that I'm just gonna destroy. If you if you ever see an enchanted creeper, you should run. Is. Can it map the entire way? No way, it actually can. What? Here it is. I don't understand why there's a chest here. Sometimes uh, uh, the jungle ones have been a little bit longer than I'd like. So hopefully that's not the case with this. I don't think it is because I'm pretty sure that we're going through this relatively quickly. The boss is not at all hard. I destroyed him on the default edition. Default. Default. See? I should be able to destroy him. Adventure by technology. This shouldn't be too much of a challenge. I really hope it isn't because it is. Yes, I mean, who knows what happened? I'm all 
already down. So, oh, we got two more to spare. Oh, wait. I don't particularly like them, but the fact that they only do one combo at long range, really attractive. Especially for this kind of combo I got. I also like the snowball. I forgot how OP it is. It's not exactly a super incredible enchant, but it's definitely not a bad one. Not great for boards and mobs, but pretty good for solitary ones. We got the meditating cat, guys. Great. Meditating cat. Why am I carrying TNT on my head? Why didn't I not get rid of this? Here, you take TNT. If that doesn't finish you off, here, take another. You are not supposed to be alive. Yeah, no, that did not work. <coughs> Open the gate. Oh look, I can see all the way down there. Oh dear, we got an ambush. Well, it's time to whip them. Make some of
I just fell. That was so nearly. Take out this zombie. Okay, I gotta take this because there's a horde of enemies. Here's the next stuff we're to hold. Start breaking down the horde. Let's go this way now. Deal with the other half. I love how this has so many twists and turns. It's so, it has so much to explore. There's so much to find. Wow, this trap. Is that chest over here? I like the cost of this. This must be like. Where a chest is or whatever, because like an open carry. No, of course not. Why are there drowned? Why are drowned helping out the poison? Oh, but they're an alliance. Okay, that makes sense. Level 96. Which I'm gonna be able to do another video. Hopefully. Yeah. Stuff. This is gonna be worth so many emeralds. So, so many emeralds. Here we go, time to deal with the other Careless. 
that death comes in entirely just like the first one. So, I've got one life to spare still. Oh, thank goodness, no more ambushes. 
Not sure we're nearing the end. I don't know though. Whoa, tridents! Oh my goodness, that's way too OP. Look at that damage. It's crazy. A lot better than arrows, I'll tell you that. just a little. But they are very different. This, I believe, is the final challenge. Oh, never mind. No, it's not. 
We still have to be temple hunter before we reach the boss. Which wasn't very tough on default mode, but we're playing adventure mode here and everything is tough. Oh, treetop! Oh, never mind. That's the boss, or mid boss, or whatever. Treetop Whisper. Doesn't have much health, but uh, yeah, of course it comes with some. The ones of protection. It comes with the, the ones of protection. Guards. And of course, you. Of course, you. Yeah. Of course. Of course, he's got these giant leaf leaves. Oh! This guy's here's lightning. I'm just running in circles. <laughs> I got a travel blocks achievement while I'm running away from these guys. More lightning, but they're so tough that it doesn't even do that much. And he's regening, I forgot that he can do that, I suppose. And the last time he didn't have the chance. Really freezing? That's not what I need right now. Wait, thorns only applies to healing? That's right. Oh, dodge. Down. It's just me and the treetop whisper. <laughs> He's not much of a boss, but those two, they were. They made it a pretty good fight. So, there we have it. There you have it. I'm My wrist hurts. My wrist hurts. From how much I've been doing Minecraft dungeons. My wrist literally hurts. Okay, we've clearly got a ton of stuff, so we're gonna try and sort it out. So none of the weapons in here need better. Melee weapons. I'm not interested in bows, so we're gonna get rid of all, even though this one supposedly is better. And this one's unique, so it doesn't even matter. Anyway, here, the only way that they- I mean, oh, there's no way I'm even gonna consider any of these except for this one. Then it'll come down to enchants. Let's see. This thing only has two. It has rapid fire and gravity. It deals uh, a certain amount of damage. <laughs> a certain amount of damage. Okay. Anyway. It deals slightly more damage and it's rapid fires. But I can rapid fire. This is a terrible enchant. This is a not terrible, but not very good. In the end, this is not worth keeping around. None of the armor is better. Oh, uh, I just got rid of the boss with that candidate. Oh, this one has three enchants. So, Tumblebee isn't that bad. The protection offers significantly worse, but it also offers thorns. Which, in my opinion, is absolutely insane. This one actually has a better chance. So, in my opinion, this thing isn't gonna make it. <coughs> this also an armor. Right, right here, it's the like, head. First of all, it's got Final Shout, so we can keep that really good one. This thing has Final Shout and Acrobat and Snowball. The only good one really is Final Shout. And then the fact that the potion. Oh, wow, that's OP. Okay. That's even better. So I think this one's definitely going to replace it. Even though it has less chance and less defense points, 
It does have a 35% damage reduction, and the fact that I, I can, like, every time I drink a potion of healing, I literally, practically, I, I reduce the damage that I take in by 90%, and that's insane. In the time, we've also got other things that they are selling me. A satchel of elements that's level 77, which is supposedly the same level. 5,224 artifact damage. Oh, this one actually is better somehow. Oh, because it's rare. So, wait, what? I don't understand why this deals 120. This one deals 120 more damage, surprisingly. Anyway, the corrupted beacon I have no use for. So now I got a slightly better special elements. This is the Stormlander, and I'm gonna buy it. Look how many unique items I got. This chest is chock full of it. And it's insane. Like, is this the storage limit? Is this the maximum that it can store? Or is it down here? I think it's down here. But this means that I'm approaching the absolute limit I can store of unique items. I might have to go on some legendary hunts to complete all these unique items I've been storing up. Anyway, that's all for now. Thank you all for watching this video, and I'll see you around next time.